What's up everybody and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, you're gonna see me and Yee Yee fishing out at the Tom Bigby River, doing a little bit of tail race catfishing. Now I made a rookie mistake in this one. As all you guys that do YouTube know, you always gotta have the cameras around, always gotta have them rolling in case something happens. I had initially went down here just planning on doing some fun fishing. I wasn't planning on recording, wasn't planning on making a video, but it was apparent from the first fish that I caught that I mean, I should have brought my camera equipment out of my truck, should have had it down there at the dam with us. So I mean, the first fish that I landed, got a 20 pound blue cat i ended up giving him to these other folks because me and jacob we weren't planning on keeping fish i'll show him right here at the start of the video y'all should see a clip of me showing the fish laying there but yeah i really wish i would have started off bringing the camera equipment with me and actually been filming from the get-go like i should have I need to stop making little rookie mistakes like that all right now a couple things before we do get this thing going first off i want to give a big shout out to the combat fishing vet appreciate you sending me the sticker jesse but if any of you guys don't have jesse i'll put uh, i'll put his info down in the description below Y'all can check it out, pick up his channel if you like what he's uh, what he's got going on. Here is gonna be your home on the boat windshield right here, Jesse. Well, right here in the corner below the AFCO sticker. There it is. But yeah, if y'all are enjoying the content that I've been putting out, make sure to smash that like button. And if you hadn't already subscribed to the channel, please consider subscribing. It would be greatly appreciated. Thank you guys that do watch the videos for all the support. Y'all stay tuned. Let's see how it turns out. So I didn't have the GoPro on, wasn't recording, but I got this big son of a gun. He's uh, just a little over 20 pounds. Got him on a little old duck at Jacob Wheeler, seven foot medium heavy rod and the SLX. That was a fight, I tell you what. Well, we got him on, I actually had this little lead jig spoon type thing that I, that I bought down at the beach for fishing for a uh, Spanish mackerel with. But I was chucking it around the first little bit we was here, didn't get any strikes, nothing more to have anything to do with it. So I actually ended up taking one of these rocks right here on the ground and I beat the shininess off of it, made it, uh, gave it more of a dull appearance. The first cast after I did that, that old big one decided to hammer it. But we, uh, we're gonna put it out there some more, and see if we can get some more cats. Y'all, I'm gonna take a second to explain what I'm doing. What I've got, I've just got a, uh, like a lead type spoon on here, like I showed y'all earlier. What I'm doing is I'm throwing it straight out ahead of me right here in this trough all the way against where that wing wall comes out. At that point, I'm locking my spool, keeping a tight line, letting it drift right there along that wall. And by the time I get to the end of it, if I don't have a hit, I just reel it up. But when they hit it, I mean, they hit it like a freight train, like that fits and take the thing out of your hands. But pretty much all you do is just cast it out, let it sink to the bottom, keep a tight line, drift down the wing wall. You don't get a bite, reel it in, and repeat the process. I hooked up on something. I think it's a drum. This ain't no catfish. A little whatever it is. I do believe we got a little drum. Yeah. We don't want that, but... Had a dude. My mother-in-law was telling me they were good eating, but I ain't never, I ain't never tried one. Yeah, all the people like. They are pretty good though. Y'all, I just gave them away because I ain't never tried a drum. Them folks wanted to try to eat him. Now, me y'all, uh, any y'all ever tried drum before? Drop it down in the comments. And let me know if y'all have. Let me know what it tastes like. know what it tastes like and how y'all cook it. I ain't got nothing for this one. We had a freaking monster on him now, y'all. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever it is, it's got some size to it. Hey, you know, hook them in the back. Yeah, I just seen it. Yeah, I 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 seen it. Yeah. Y'all 
Y'all, this is a freaking beast. This little duck that Jacob Wheeler ain't made for this stuff. There he is. Sir. I've tried to get him turned, but. Oh, I think it got me in something. Got me on. Got me on. Got him out. He come off though. They let him get next to this wall. Yeah. It's cash mill. And they throw him and pull him on the barnacles on this wall. Uh-huh. They get to this wall and get to this wall and get to this wall. Yeah, the way I had him in that tail wasn't doing it with him. You couldn't pull him out of that current. You could get him right there, but you couldn't pull him. Yep. That current in that number one. If he right here, he picked up that current every time he jumped back. Yeah, yeah. Been there, done that. Oh. That was fun, though. <laughs> I figured I said he got some hole right now. I knew, as soon as he did it, I knew it. <laughs> I felt it on my man, it's, it's, so it's, over, it's, over, it's over with. Oh well. Yeah, you're right though. You yeah. Hi right, y'all, between me and Jacob, we're one for three on the big ones and the one that we do have caught, I didn't have the camera going, so don't really do y'all much good for watching. <laughs> we're gonna try to get another one though. Alright, Jacob's got a little more manageable one this time. This one ain't taking him for a ride. Yeah. Oh. It's still a decent one he's got though. I mean, shoot, that's a 10 pounder. Don't you think? All right, I got Jacob's rod now while he uh, runs down here to land his fish. About a 10 pound blue cat. Heck yeah. Well, like I said a while ago, if y'all had never tried catfishing with spoons, this right here is the stuff. You got to do it. You have got to do it. It is yee yee fishing approved. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's on the little Runkle spoon. Got those off of Runkle's website for only 99 cents for the whole pack of them. There's like 10 of them. That, well, I don't know if it's 10 of them. There's a few of them in it. For 99 cents now. For a whole pack of them. 99 cents. Can't beat that. Yeah, y'all go to runkle.com. I'll put a link right here. Right here somewhere, wherever. Get y'all some of them. I think they still got the sale going on where you can get them for 99 cents. Let's see. Uh, that ain't as big as I thought it was. That's about, uh, about five or six. That's like at least seven. Think so? At least seven. Oh, yeah. We are finally hooked up after a long drought. Finally got another one. This one don't feel near as big though. Yeah. Probably one of those. Drone. Nah, this ain't no drone. Dang. Yeah, de definitely a cat. Good one too. The 
this one ain't near as big as the one we did battle with earlier. He ain't that big. I'm starting to wonder if it's even a cat because they ain't fighting no more. See if we can land this one for y'all. Barely got him. We got to get him in quick. Oh, no, I got him. That is a nice one, y'all. Probably about shoot, 12, 13 pounder. Y'all ain't keeping fish either, are y'all? No. Nah. Nah, we gonna let him go because ain't nobody else here keeping keep, keeping a uh, fish at this point. Yeah, it's fun on a little medium heavy bass rod. Can't beat it. Y'all, I'm about whooped for the day, but I'm gonna at least get in one more cast. Gotta get some other one. All right, it's gonna be a wrap for this one. I didn't catch a whole lot of fish, but between the ones that I did and the ones that I did battle with that I didn't land, I'm absolutely whooped. I've had enough of it. They beat me, they've won. Time to call it quits. Mr. Jacob, he, he says it's time to call it quits too. That's the best day of catfishing we've done every time. Hey, I mean, that beats, that beats set rig fishing any day. I mean, some of you catfish are make you mad about that, but that right there, I mean, that's, that's a blast. I mean, fishing fishing with those lead spoons or whatever, I don't know what to call them. I mean, jig, jig spoons, I, mean, I guess they're jigs. But yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed that one. Appreciate y'all watching. Thank y'all for the support. We'll see y'all next time.